My name's Mark McGuire. I'm a cardiologist. I work at the Mater Hospital. Yes, so our electrophysiology room, that's a, like an operating theatre for the treatment of abnormal heart rhythms, has been extensively upgraded. We uh, have upgraded the x-ray equipment, which means we could obtain better pictures of the heart with a lower dose of x-rays, in other words, a lower dose of radiation. Uh, this is state-of-the-art equipment. We've also upgraded our mapping system. So in order to treat an abnormal heart rhythm, you need to find out which part of the heart is coming from. So we have uh, installed state-of-the-art mapping equipment. So the most common abnormal heart rhythm is atrial fibrillation. Uh, this is a condition which causes the heart to beat uh, rapidly and irregularly. And that can cause the patient to have a stroke, uh, to black out, to become short of breath. And this uh, abnormal heart rhythm is becoming more and more frequent. It uh, affects uh, about 10% of people over the age of 80 years old. The MATA has a comprehensive service for the treatment of abnormal heart rhythms. In fact, we have uh, six cardiac electrophysiologists. That's, uh, a cardiac electrophysiologist is a doctor who specialises in the treatment of abnormal heart rhythms. So we have six of, six of these doctors, all very skilled, all expert in their field, which is a bigger department than uh, many university or teaching hospitals. So we uh, provide a very comprehensive service here. We diagnose abnormal heart rhythms. We treat abnormal heart rhythms with a technique called catheter ablation, in which we freeze or burn uh, ab uh, electrical short circuits, which cause abnormal heart rhythms. We implant uh, patients with pacemakers if their hearts beat too slowly. We implant uh, devices called defibrillators, which treat dangerous, fast abnormal heart rhythms. So we provide a comprehensive service for the treatment of abnormal heart rhythms, which I believe is second to none in the country. <laughs>